Thank you, Rishabh. Uh, hello, everyone. I am Ijaz, engineer at Frappe. Uh, so it all started with, a, with an interview. Like I wanted to join the Frappe. I applied uh, first time, then I got rejected. And I applied again. I applied four times, but I haven't got shortlisted for the interview. So I texted Rishabh that, hey, I want to join Frappe. And this is how I got shortlisted for the interview. And my... <laughs> My first round was with Rushab. Uh, I was sitting next to him. He just opened the GitHub issues and shortlisted, uh, like uh, sorted the GitHub issues by most reaction. As you can see, it has 21 thumbs up. So this was the most requested by the community at that time. Horizontal scrollable child table. So he asked me like, will you do this? I said yes. So yeah, this is how the horizontal scrollable child table feature was built. Here is a quick demo. Now, you can add as many columns as you want in the child table. And uh, now there is no restrictions of 10 columns or n number of columns. <laughs> but when, when this feature got merged, uh, there is one issue, like if I scroll the item, uh, as you can see item, it also got scrolled with all the details. Uh, and sometimes we want some details, uh, some important details like item, item name or quantity or rate to stick to the left while I scroll. So I can see the uh, important uh, details while I scroll. So for this, uh, we have built, like we have shipped another feature uh, called a sticky column or pin column to the left. Yeah, so that we can view important details while we scroll or we do other operations. Uh, when this feature got merged, I posted it on LinkedIn I, and got lots of love from the community, like as you can see, 18.2K impressions, near about 350 likes. And then uh, uh, community wanted same thing in the list view, like we have in the grid view or child table. Uh, because same restrictions was in the list, so you can add only 10 columns. And even if you add 10 columns, it's very hard to see the details. So to fix this issue, we have made list view scrollable, horizontal scrollable. And now there's no restrictions. You can add columns without any restrictions. But yeah, this is how, here is a quick, quick demo. Yeah, while I was working on this, uh, like uh, this is a very frustrating thing for me, the list view mobile design. Like uh, if you see in the version 15, the filters are by default open and you can see only one column with status. But in the new list view design, which will come in version 16, you can uh, add two more columns to the list view. Like as you can see in the list view design, the filters are by default collapsed and you can see more details in the list view design. Uh, yeah, apart from this, uh, there was a print format for doc type. We can uh, like in we can create print formats for doc type, but we don't have a option in the desk to create print format for reports. We can create uh, like uh, if you want, we can create via HTML files. Uh, like there, there are some ways, but. Now, in version 15 and version 16, we can create print formats for report. Uh, so here is a quick demo. Uh, in print format, you will get an option to select for what you have to create a print format. Uh, for example, report or doc type. And then you will have to select the report. And you, will, you can add your HTML. Uh, and the yeah, printing is same as usual. You, can, you, you will just go to the print and select the print format. Yeah, this is how. <laughs> now you can create multiple print formats for reports as well. Uh, yeah, uh, we have a option in Frappe framework to hide fields based on roles and permission. But we don't have option to hide, hide data, but show the field. Or we can say mask data, but show the field. So data masking based on roles and permission uh, will come in version 16. Uh, for, uh, with this, you can hide the important data based on roles and permission, like how roles and permission works. 
and the fields will be visible. Yeah, here is a quick demo. Uh, it's, it's just a short demo. I will just, as you can see, company is visible. I will go to the company via customized form or doc type, click on mask. I will click on the save button. And when I reload, yeah, as you can see, I don't have the permission for company to view the data, mask data. So yeah, now it is mask. In list view, in form view, in report everywhere. So yeah, that's it. Thank you. Now 